huge change coming for Ireland here. Johnny Sexton is coming off the field. Of course, he is a fan favourite. He is a legend of Irish rugby. He's been the heart and soul of this team all night. He's going to come off for the last eight minutes of this absolute nail-biter. Jack Crowley is going his replacement. Sexton leaves his country with a lead. Can they hold on to that? Here comes South Africa up the middle. Van Staden gets a beautiful ball from Kurt Lee Arnsa, who had that break for the Springboks. A tense finish we're in for. Beautiful ball back to Cochersmith from Arches Neyman. And here comes to Clark. Lebok. Unche. Steams upfield for South Africa. Trevor Nyakani with possession. Off to Clark. Can't get it. Ireland pile in. Who's there? Paul. And then it's been left behind and hoofed downfield from Ireland. A stunning steal. And they drive back to Springboks. Jesse Creel beats one. South Africa. We've got turned over at the last break time. May have lost it again. Ireland on attack. Here they come. Ball splits free to the left hand side. Now they look for some magic. Keenan, the fullback, brought down inside the 22. Here we go, release. Conor Murray with this crowd urging them on. Good ball again. Jack Crowley on the field. The cheers continue. Ian Henderson, the Ulsterman. Behind the back ball, just held on there from Hugo Keenan. The Fox doing well. Porter takes a strong hit. There's Robbie Henshaw, looks to attack. Ireland looking at the options here. Ty Byrne carries well again on the URC with Munster. And they go to the pocket. An successful attempt, but they needed to have a go. Got a scrum. Take him back. It's going to be a five-year scrum because it's charged down. Been touched in the air. Scrum did. Yeah, there it is. Touch, dear Lende. Doing a good work to charge it down, but it's actually going to fire in front of you when you're they kind of really and broke up. Hits you and goes Krill back. This is a good counter for me. Got scragged and caught. An invited Ireland to counter up. Another change for Ireland, Andrew Porter coming off the field. He's been instrumental today in that set piece. Such has been the physicality of this game. I think it's a well-deserved break for him. Yeah, it really is. Been the thick of it. He's on the park. as well. Great shot there on the Irish side. We're talking about how important compose yourselves in these moments. We're just over five to play. They're there in a huddle. Breathing in unison. And South Africa have made the final change of their bench. Their lone back, Cobus Reiner, is onto the field. Back to Clerk coming off. We well, knew Reiner was going to get on the field. And sometimes you said the only back fan favourite. Three years at Northampton Saints before he moved to France. He's got a hat against Romania, the second quickest in Rugby World Cup history behind the one he set in 2019 against Canada. This game away. Five Boys. minutes to play. They lead South Africa 10 8. Come up. Time's off. Straight down. Don't use your head on the shoulder, okay? It's your ball. Don't use your head on the shoulder. Let's reset, please. Time will go and we're ready. It's tense. It's head in hands time. You can barely watch. Just keep your weight there. Two points on the scoreboard. Five minutes to play. Ireland setting up camp at the scrum, five metres off the South African line. The experience of Conor Murray to put into this scrum. Coach! Boy! 
Action. Here we go. As the world Six. watches. On the line, please. Instability. Mac Hansen just came over to this near side to fire the crowd up. I don't think they need it, Mac. They're all on their feet. They're loving life. The substitute front row for Ireland will be very, very pleased to get one over on the bot pack. A massive moment in the game for Ireland. Jack Crowley. Pivotal role for the Munster side winning the URC this year. From close range. To make it a five-point lead. has his name in the books. It's 13 points to eight. Ireland leads South Africa with three minutes to play. Colby looks to the skies, a hint of despair in the South African eyes now. Down the middle goes South Africa. Nice lift from Ireland. Can they close out this game? OK, Green! It's a big kick yet again, two in a row. Marnie Leboc launches the counter. The flowers being had, and there's a bunch of green jerseys around there. No. Nope. Reinach retains possession for South Africa. Willems up. Magic needed from some of the playmakers. Cheslin Colby can't get free on this occasion to the halfway line. Turnover's good. A pinch and another steal from Ireland. No, Unbelievable from Bandiaki. Turnover's good. Storming with ball in hand. Believe it. And on the other side of the ball, low again, chips this one. Who's put him on? Colby, on his opposite number. 90 seconds left. So the Arbigas chance with ball in hand big hit as well Ryan wants possession Inche waits turns it behind the back the block finds Jesse Creel to the halfway line the tackles keep coming from Ireland Vantage second man hands on penalty advantage for South Africa Willemsa almost got the pass away in the tackle and ended eventually OK, you got two penalties. One penalty here for off feet. Jesse, Jesse. South Africa. Cheers on this one here. Or one over there. From the South African side. Off feet. They're not a group short of belief. They said coming into this, they love the pressure cooker. Well, it's dialed right up now. Marnie Lebock. So much said about his kicking in this game. And his shots at goal have been questionable. He's missed a few. Well, that's a nice nudge. He's given his pack an inviting oh, platform to play here. The drama unfolding in front of us at Start the France. Final play. Ireland lead, 13-8. Fareed goes to Peter Steph to toy. South Africa mauling towards the try line. Dianlendi's in there as well. Tyke Byrne, the Irish defender on the side. They've defended superbly. Where is it? So they're going to try to dig this out. It's there. Has it come out?
Shahs are smiling tonight. They've taken one step closer to their Rugby World Cup dream.